Hey guys, how's it going? My name is RGJ Runner, and welcome to Keep Them Below, a free indie horror game which you can download on Game Jolt right now. I was actually looking for a, a good indie horror to be on, to play because uh, ha Halloween it's the time to play scary games. So I came across this one because it was on the featured section. So it might be good, it might not be good. More than likely it won't be good because it was made on the Unity engine and quite a rush I'd imagine. Because just judging by the appearance alone it doesn't look that great. Nor do I expect it to look great. But I expect it to be somewhat playable but either way by the background story you inherited a farm from your recently deceased grandparents and there is some strange spooky shit going down. And probably involves a lot of black magic and sacrifices. Oh, wait, hold on. Dialogue. I've never had much of a relationship with my grandparents. To tell the truth, I've not seen them since I was a child. My parents never spoke of them. My grandparents passed away. For some reason, they left me their farm. I was to meet a solicitor at the farm to sign the final legal papers, but he did not show. I will stay the night at the farm and wait for him the next day. So you'll wait for him tomorrow? Wouldn't that be the appropriate phrase to use? Oh no, music. I cannot be playing music. Or maybe again, I'm not sure. I'm not sure if this is subject to copyright. More than likely it is, so I have to find out where the hell it is coming from. All right, comfy bed. Wardrobe? Jesus. Oh. Oh, fuck it. Duck, did I... Oh, no, I didn't break the game. Thank God. Okay. Whoa. Okay. Easy there, door mechanics. Now, where is yonder sound coming from? Or yonder music? It's not coming from here. So much come from downstairs. And I must shut that shit off quickly. Lord forbid I get the pants suit off me for playing such music. Okay. Quite time. There you go. Shh. Right. Okay, spooky empty house. Doesn't look like there, that there's much to explore. That sounded like it came from near the barn. Okay, time to explore the barn then. But not before I explore the house. Just see if there's any collectibles. Clicky, clicky. Clicky, clicky, no. Clicky, clicky. Right, not not in here. That's enough exploring done for one day. Jesus Christ, the controls are so sophisticated. Okay, I'm assuming that the barn is in yonder direction, but before I go to the barn, I'm going to explore the house a bit more. Okay, we got a shack here. Can we enter it? No. And did I feel my chair slide down? Yes, I did. Ah, I have to look into getting... What? What did I do? What did I do? What did I do? I touched something. What? I have no idea what, what I did. What did... What? I... I cannot move. I, move. God damn it, will you move? Okay, right, there you go. Okay, I think the alt is for the inventory. Okay, okay, whatever. I didn't read anything about... The alt key being used. Oh, again, I, I found a lovely trap door which leads down to the basement for some reason. And there's probably going to be a spooky ghost down here, no doubt. Okay, bring it on. What you got for me? What you got for me? A rope and a shovel. Am I going to murder someone? Yeah, more than likely. Can I pick up the rope as well? Oh, okay. I'm assuming that shovel is going to be used for burying a body. Cool. That's that's nice. We're, we're in fact, you know what? We're probably the ones who kidnapped that girl. And we're probably going to hit her o over the head with a shovel. All right, it's slaughtering time. One, two, Robbie's coming for you. 
tree for luck that burn door. <laughs> One, two, left. Oh, oh, never mind. I'm not getting out. Hello, are you okay? Look, stick cam. I'm going to look for a way to open the barn door and get you out. I'll be back. Lock is rusted. I need something to break it. Like what? <laughs> Can't we just use the shovel? I guess not. Well, whatever, Trevor. Guess we have to find a key or pick up some break or some object that can break it. I thought we might have used the shovel, but apparently not. Now, where on earth do I go? Do I go through here? Maybe, possibly? No? Or am I fall for. Okay, I've. I've we're just about two minutes in. Oh, wait, never mind. Okay, I fixed it. Never mind. Game is fixed. But honestly, where do I go? There's, there doesn't seem to be any set path for me to, to travel. <sighs> and this lantern is about as useful as tits on a fish. Really couldn't, you couldn't have upped the brightness on it, maybe? Or, opti or optic glowing effect or was that simply too much effort mm. <sighs> right oh there's another pat up here where does this lead oh it leads up here for more exploration good Hello, Senor Scarecrow. Right, where do I need to be going? I'm not even sure if I should be here or not. Because there's no... Clear path. Hmm, I'm just going to assume that was me and I stepped on a twig. Either that or, or it was just nothing. Just a whole lot... Of nothing. Okay, fine. I guess I can't go that way. Maybe I have to go into this house. It's locked. Hmm. I'm guessing we need to find a key of some sort. But where does one find a key? Wait, look at this place. It's so vast it could take me feckin' ages. I'm not sure if you can hear that noise. Hmm. Guess the trees are creaking with their old age. Oh dear, a grave. I guess this is what I picked up the shovel for, but why are you defiling a grave? Is it oh, a key. Hmm, you know what, I was expecting a monster to be right behind me. Either that or this dead person is going to get up and chase me and do the oogie boogie. Huh, so I guess this is the key to the house that we were just at? Or maybe it's to be used on the barn door. I'm assuming it's going to be used on, on the house here. That would make the most sense. You know, I'm going to check this place out first because it's a lot closer. Okay, yeah, well, yeah, I do go in here. Okay, someone's nomming on something. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. <sighs> really? You couldn't have just uh, used, you know, uh, some blood scrawl uh, text effect. No, it had to be something. Some some sort of Microsoft Word text, Arial font or something. I'm not sure, but that that just really takes away from the game. Okay, now who's numbing numbing? Oh, 
Hello. You got something for dinner? You got something for dinner there? Okay. Red eyes everywhere. Red eyes, red eyes everywhere. Red eyes. All they know is hunger. I'll say. That guy was chowing down something mighty fine there. I wonder what it was. Oh, but jeez, that text though. That is just something else. They wouldn't take me. They took my child, but they wouldn't take me. They want more. Bring them more to keep them low in the dark. I'm sorry. Jeez. Really, that makes no sense. They have blood spatters and just, uh... Aerial font. It look, looks like aerial font. I mean, normally I'd be... Normally, in any horror game, you'd, you'd just be scrawled on the wall in, in a... a in some sort of cheap blood effect. But, uh. No, not in this. Is that something outside? Is that oh no, that's just a reflection off the lantern. Okay. Now I'm assuming this thing is going to burst out of here at any moment and chase me. No? Alright then. Anyway, I got my pickaxe, so I'm assuming I'm going to bust open the lock with that. Can I close this? Oh, no, of course not. Why would I be able to close it? That would make too much sense. So is this it? I just un unlock the door, free this damsel in distress, and re run away and live happily ever after? Or is that going to be one of those monsters that's supposed to be locked in here? Okay, fine. Well, only time will tell. Smashy, smashy. Oh, she stopped crying. Hi Hello? Little girl. Little woman. Are you here? Oh. That, that's just nasty. Okay, where are you? Are you not up here? Are you playing games? Did you fall down here? You probably fell down here. Oh, fucking Jesus Christ. Ow. Oh, dear. I got slapped in the face with a candelabra. That didn't feel good. Okay, get up, you wimp. Okay, I... I can't... I can't move. Did my game freeze? Or is it my computer? I have no idea. Um... Oh... Yeah, my game froze. Right, okay, let's see if the game actually works this time. No! No, it, it... It froze again. It... It... It freaking... Froze. That's great. That... That is perfect. That... That is absolutely fantastic. No, I'm just gonna assume... That maybe... I have to complete the tasks... In a particular order, so... Maybe first I have to go to the barn, then I have to run back here, grab the shovel, and uh, dig up, go to the house, dig up the body, come back to the barn. Ma maybe that's, maybe I'm doing them in the wrong order, and that's what's causing the game to crash. And if it's something as simple as that, then Jesus Christ, even I know that's bad programming. I would know because I, I freaking do Java in college. And we get Eden alive if we do something the wrong way. Coding is love, coding is life. And this this ain't proper coding that's going in here. So uh, 
I'll be back in a minute, and if it does not work, then fuck it, I'll call it a video, because I'm not going to waste my time with with some, something like this. If someone can't put in the, the effort to call the game properly, then it's not worth doing it as a let's play. So I'll see you in a bit. Alrighty then, I've got my pickaxe, and I'm ready to bust open this lock for the third time. So... <laughs> I'm assuming, sh shut up lady, third time's a charm, okay? Come on, there has, there has to be some redemption here, come on. Just, do not piss me off. Do not piss me off by fucking randomly breaking. Oh, hello. Ouchies, again, with the candelabra. Now, let's just sit back, relax, and see what I'll be able to move this time around. Well, this has been the greatest waste of half an hour, or 20 minutes, but the video ain't gonna be 20 minutes in length, hold on, did, did it move? No, it didn't, it, it, it didn't move, no, 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 it's broke, it's broke, wait, hold on, hold on, wait, yeah, it, it's broke, it, it, it's broke. We, we can't do, do anything about it. I can't do any, any, anything about it. It's broke anyway. As I was saying before, this video is not going to be 20 minutes length. It, in fact, it'll only be about 15 because I've cut out most of the gameplay. Oh boy. This game was terrible. I was, I was hoping it would be um, uh, somewhat scary. And I was, I was expecting it to be a, a little buggy uh, honestly I, r I really was but this w is full of bugs as you can see it's nearly unplayable to for me at least i haven't come across a any let's plays off of gs mainly because i didn't search for them so uh, i will s search for them uh, once i've finished this once i've done editing it and put it on youtube but oh deary me i swear to god if i had a working ps3 controller i'd be playing silent hill or F forbidden siren right about now I love those games. I love them with a passion. But I'm searching Game Jolt and other and other gaming websites for free horror games to play for for Halloween. Oh, but yikes! I've really hit a brick wall in this. This is such a disappointment, guys, and I'm sorry. Uh, but guys, you know what to do. If you like this video, which I highly doubt you will, be sure to leave a thumbs up, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next one. So, until next time, see ya.